Hey everybody, so welcome back. I wanted to talk to you all today about how I trim my hair. Um, so my ends were absolutely horrible and neglected um, in the past couple of months and so I decided to trim them. Um, so in this video I had already trimmed the back area so as you can see I don't have scraggly messed up ends. Um, so I'm just going to kind of break down my process for you guys um, so you don't always have to go to the salon to keep your ends up. So this is freshly washed hair. Um, so as you can see I'm just taking it into you know pretty small sections. Um, the ends are just horrible looking. I've got a lot of split ends, single strand knots, all of those things. So you always want to start off with your favorite leave-in conditioner and I take, you know, as you can see, just a little dollop of it and I apply it straight to the ends um, because that's the kind of the biggest thing is that your ends aren't getting enough moisture. And so I rake that through the ends and work it all the way up through my hair. And then I take my favorite wide tooth comb or whatever your detangling tool is um, and just slowly work out all of the knots and kinks until you're able to um, literally comb or brush from the roots all the way down. Okay, so now that I've done that and it's thoroughly detangled, I just go and make a normal knot. I don't, or a twist I should say. So it's nothing special in particular. It's literally just a regular twist. Um, and even though you know that you're going to clip the ends, you really want to resist the temptation to kind of stop. You want to literally twist all the way down to the very end as if you were styling and that was it. Um, so go down to the very, very last piece, even if it's just one little strand of hair, um, so that your twist is complete. And it should look like this. Now, it's going to be really easy at this point to see where your hair is thinning, um, to see where there's weird strands, and wherever it's starting to look bad, I just clip right above that. So as you can see, I don't even know if it was like a quarter of an inch. It's very small. You can barely even tell. Um, but now those ends are gone. So I'm just going to speed it up um, and show you a couple more times so you can follow it. Now there's a lot of different methods on the internet. You'll see some people will kind of go down and they'll trim wherever their hair gets kind of thin or see-through. My hair is pretty thick everywhere um, and there's moments where you can kind of see through everywhere depending on how you're, you know, I guess looking at your hair. So that's not really a reliable method for me. Um, but twisting all the way down and then looking to see where it's just really bad and and scraggly and jacked up and everything you can think of um, is best for me. So as you can see I just did a couple of twists and I'm going to take my shears and clip right there and you can tell the difference. I'm going to do it again. Always use hair shears and not just regular scissors um, so you can get a very clean cut on what you're doing. All right, so now I'm on the other side and I'm just gonna show you a little, again, a little closer, especially because this end was really messed up. Now I always start off by finger detangling. So that's what you're seeing me do there. I'm literally pushing um, my thumb through and then just kind of detangling myself. And then I go get my comb. So here we are again. We're gonna twist, twist, twist all the way to the end. And you're going to know and feel, you know, when things aren't right and when it's no longer healthy. So when you see that, I always go just slightly above it. I don't go like right where I start to see things going bad. I clip just above that area. So I know for sure that I've gotten all of the split ends, all of um, the damage. And most of this for me is just physical damage of having my hands in my hair too much and what have you. Here I've got a lot of single strand knots hanging down. So I'm just going to go and I'm going to whoop, clip. A lot of people are scared to trim their hair. Um, but honestly, again, you know, I'm not like cutting it. I'm not shaping it or anything. This is literally just a trim to make sure that you keep your ends healthy. Anybody can do this. As you can see, it doesn't take a lot of skill. Um, it's literally just you like twisting as you normally would and then just seeing those um, 
those bad ends there and getting rid of it. And so now I have no more single strand knots. You don't see all these scraggly split ends. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And if it wasn't helpful, exit out the browser you entered. I'll see you guys next time.